Hi, welcome to my channel Geography with Narendranath. Today's very important uh, class earthquake. Basically, in this class, also explain there are earthquake introduction and there is the measurement of earthquake and earthquake constructive effect and there is the also explain cause of earthquake and consequence of effect of earthquake and earthquake forecasting and also they are explained overall elaborately I will explain must will watching and if you are new must will subscribe my channel and click bell icon for notification now start today's very important uh, topic earthquake basically you know uh, earthquake if you question here the what is the earthquake basically uh, any sudden vibration uh, or movement of a part of the earth cast uh, basically caused by natural or man-made trees and resulting in uh, violent uh, tremor or sacking and uh, there are the trembling is called earthquake you know <clears throat> it can be defined as a shock or series of shocks due to uh, sudden movement of uh, crystal rock and generated at a point and known as the seismic force uh, within cast and mantle the point uh, basically uh, so this model uh, the point for the shock wave uh, basically seismic wave uh, reach the surface is termed as the epicenter and it is directly above the focus point and uh, the effect of earthquake are greater if it is seismic force and lies near uh, the f surface of the earth and uh, the wave generated by an earthquake are recorded by uh, instrument called the seismograph you know and seismometer and the science of earthquake is known as the seismology clear there are the seismograph and uh, seismometer and seismology next there are the earthquake are one of the most hazards and natural phenomena because of the extent of damage uh, to life and property they cause all around man has been unable to control his uh, disaster and it is the helpless against this nature and uh, Trinity. and basically uh, one can judge the magnitude of destruction by the example of earthquake which occurred in may 31 1970 and the northern peru uh, resulting the 66000 death you know and uh, the number of people uh, who lost of their life and property in the january 2000, uh, 26 2001 gujarat earthquake you know about 30000 people and recently their biggest under the sea earthquake result in travel disaster with nearly 240,000 people killed in uh, South Asia and of the west coast of the Sumatra, Indonesia and it's occurred the 26 December 2004 with an 8.9 and magnitude on the Richter scale is very big um, uh, brought uh, and this uh, diagram you know and cause of uh, basically and uh, next you know uh, the cause of earthquake uh, the main cause of the earthquake under the volcanic eruption and plate tectonic and faulting faulting anthropogenic factors so first of all i explained there are first point the volcanic eruption basically volcanic eruption is one of the main cause of the earthquake and uh, volcanic uh, earthquake are caused uh, by the gas explosion and such earthquake occur either simultaneously with eruption or more commonly in the period of uh, presiding and eruption and there generally a shallow origin and their area of disturbance and the relatively small and rarely exist a few hundred square kilometer you know and their intensity however may be quite higher than the volcano and uh, it is very important the volcanic uh, then uh, violent eruption of you know, uh, between the sumatra and java island and cause such as the severe earthquake and that is impact was experienced and the cape horn uh, approx 12800 kilometer and karagata earthquake generally 30 to 40 meters uh, high uh, tsunami uh, sea waves and who is killed over 36 thousand people in the coastal area of java and sumatra and the as cloud rise into the uh, mesosphere and sound of blast were heard in the central australia the philippine philippines and sever uh, 5000 kilometer away in the indian ocean and such volcanic eruption uh, always result in severe earthquake of 
a hazard nature basically and next very important point uh, folding and faulting basically a fracture in a rock alone which there has been uh, an observable amount of displacement is known as fault and uh, basically this characteristics uh, basically earthquake occur when movement of the earth takes place along a line fracture called a fault and such earthquake are called tectonic uh, earthquake and the san andres fault of california is a typical example who is as the earthquake is uh, 1906 and anthropogenic factor is very important for cause of earthquake uh, basically human interaction with nature is also one of the main cause of the occurrence in many and uh, the earthquake and uh, it is the extraction of the minerals and deep underground mining and blasting rock by dynamic of the construction road dam and the rivers and nuclear explosion and uh, basically many of the earthquake of the world in the present country are the result of construction of the dam and reservoir you know the earthquake of 1931 uh, in greece has been attributed of the uh, marathon dam construction 1929 and uh, basically the kaina earthquake of 1967 you, say, you know uh, in the uh, satara district in maharashtra was due to kaina reservoir construction in 1962 so next uh, i explain about uh, the, the measurement of earthquake basically uh, the magnitude of earthquake is most uh, commonly associated by uh, the richter scale uh, you know uh, i explain which was the uh, devised by an eminence and seismologist and charles f richter in 1935 and they are mo- uh, modified in 1965 by richter and his challenge beno gutenberg and the scale can be related to the energy released at the earthquake and center and thus can be used and the estimated of the severity of particular earthquake the scale has neither the fixed maximum nor the minimum but earthquake rated as high as 8.4 and the richter scale have been uh, measured for the figure and basically intensity of the earthquake you know a very important uh, what is the intensity when we measure the earthquake the intensity uh, or destructive power of an earthquake is uh, measured in relation to the effect of earthquake human life and generally destruction is described in term of damage caused of building dam breeze and other structure of the reported by witness and distribution of earthquake you know the earthquake have defined pattern of the distribution the distribution different type of pattern earthquake so in the uh, variability and so and there are the Uh, three major belts in the world and who is, is the earthquake frequently occur and this earthquake belt uh, number one the fast uh, come pacific belt and their boundary mid atlantic belt you know and mid continental and uh, interpolation seismology and the basically number one the circum pacific belt the widespread and the intense earthquake activities and occurrence along the subduction zone and convergent plate boundary the circum pacific belt extends in this west form Alaska to Kerala and Japan Mariana and the Philippines and trains and view of this area divided into two branch of the going towards the uh, Indonesia trench in over the towards uh, Karamak Tunga and trench in the northwest of the New Zealand you know and also very important on the eastern side of pacific earthquake zone and follow the west coastal and uh, north america and continue southwest in the peru and chile and trench and west coast of south america also and most these are earthquake have uh, their focus on more than 25 deep and about uh, 66% of the total earthquake of the world and record of the belt and the mid atlantic belt you know this belt is earthquake extend along the mid oceanic reefs and several island there are the reefs of atlantic ocean the sea floor spreading is the main cause of earthquake in the belt and earthquake of moderate in the mild intensity with the shallow and recorded the belt in the rift valley and the east africa and red sea consider the extent of the belt so very interesting and uh, next uh, number 3 the mid continental belt is very important this is the earthquake belt extend along the alpine mountain system of europe you know and uh, north america and uh, asia and mirror there are caucasia iran afghanistan pakistan and himalayan mountain system including tibet and pamir and tanzania and the altai mountain uh, china 
of uh, China and Myanmar and Eastern Siberia also. This zone uh, basically is characterized by large earthquake of uh, shallow origin and some of intermediates uh, origin and deep focus earthquake are almost uh, absent in the belt uh, about 21 percent of the total earthquake are record in the belt and interplate sismi city uh, basically uh, although most of the world and seismicity occurs alone plate boundary and the continental platform also experience and infrequent on the scattered shallow focus earthquake the zone of earthquake in east africa and the western united states and peninsular india are most tracking uh, in a similar uh, but uh, uh, smaller uh, interference that earthquake occur in Luthar and September 30, 1993, and a village where the Sekar over the 11,000 people died. Uh, next, I explain there are the consequences of the earthquake, their type of uh, damage basically. There is a building collapse and building knock to their foundation and landslides, fear, and they're different uh, problem. The people can be uh, trapped in collapsed building or under the a rebel that the collapse into the street and this is uh, the type of damage and that lead to words uh, basically the worst things uh, to do in earthquake is to uh, rush out into trade a uh, street during the quake and the danger from being uh, hit by falling glass and uh, debris is many times greater in front of the building than inside uh, in 1989 uh, loma loma pretty quake uh, the street of San Francisco and finally district were covered by broken uh, glass and people were worried under the uh, fake it of a free building in the field forward into the street and basically building knocked off their foundation uh, building that can otherwise uh, withstand the quake and can be knocked off their foundation and severely damaged and landslide is very uh, building can be damaged when the ground gives away and beneath them and this can be from a landslide and downhill or um, that the soil and can be cause several uh, setting of the ground and uh, fear uh, often the break out of following the earthquake uh, they can be caused by flammable materials uh, being uh, thrown into a cooking and the heating and broken lights and uh, major consequence of the earthquake basically deformation of the ground surface damage and destruction of the human establishment the road breeze dam town cities loss of human and the cattle lives and you know loss of uh, property also earthquake uh, inflate the great damage uh, to uh, building road railway damage and dam bridge and damage to property more uh, serious in this area of unconsolidated material such as alluvium and colluvium and uh, basic and loss of human uh, live lives also it has been estimated that one of ever is about 15,000 people are killed every year by earthquake you know and there have been earthquake of uh, great magnitude in the dense population area in the world in who is of uh, lacks and lost of lives and basically flash flood uh, was many times under the impact of severe earthquake the dam ember the develop and freezer and there's a cause of the flash for vault and tsunami is very seismic sea waves and the seismic waves and traveling through their ocean and sea water and result into the high uh, sea wave and who is that the known as the tsunami tsunami is a japanese term and who is has been universally adapted in the disk of the large seismically generated sea wave and this wave are capable of causing considerable and destruction in certain uh, coastal area especially their uh, submarine earthquake occurs basically and uh, another their rise and subsistence of the uh, ground surface basically under the impact of several earthquake the land and rise to subsidence into wake up zone and from the example of awesome earthquake uh, 1897 you know and uh, subsidence measuring over 10 meters and wide than 20 kilometers and indian rivers uh, indian uh, river delta was uh, uh, deformed into the earthquake in 1890 you know and uh, another effect another constructive effect basically earthquake may result fissure opening the causing of geyser and hot spring and which are usually from a medicinal point of view of man and sometimes earthquake result of 
formation of the coastal submergence and change of coastal forms formally vice and uh, they are the helpful navigation earthquake forecasting making the forecasting about the occurrence of an uh, earthquake in region place to time and still different proportion also and uh, this is very important there are the uh, in fact uh, live some earthquake december 2004 uh, uh, tsunami uh, 26 december the world most powerful earthquake last 40 years and over the indian iceland just the north of uh, simulate Iceland off for the western coast of Sumatra, Indonesia, magnitude ranging from 8.9 to 9.3 Richter scale on 26 December 2004. It was under the earthquake, the Andaman and Nicobar Iceland experienced the 8 after shock and raining from 6 to 6.8 Richter scale. You know, the earthquake generated, uh, generated a massive tsunami that uh, devastated the shore. Uh, of Indonesia, Sri Lanka, South India, Thailand, Andaman, Nicobar, and well, there are two lakh forty thousand people. So also, that caused serious damage and uh, death. Uh, there are the coastal area Africa among eight thousand kilometer away from the epicenter. And you know also a uh, tsunami. Basically, what is tsunami? Uh, is very important. And sometimes the question tsunami. A uh, tsunami is a Japanese word, and which means harbor and wave. Tsu means harbor and Nami stand for wave and tsunami are large waves that are generated when the sea floor is deformed by seismic activity and vertically displacing the overlying water in the ocean as the tsunami cross the deep ocean it is the wavelength and distance from the crest to just maybe 100 kilometer or more than it is uh, amplitude uh, amplitude basically half of vertical distance between two uh, cons uh, con consecutive uh, crust may be uh, tens of feet and main cause the plate tectonic very important uh, basically main causes of the plate tectonic the earth surface consists of several plot plate and who is composed both uh, continental and oceanic lithosphere and these plate move relatively to more another and the average speed of few inch in the year and earthquake are Volcanic eruption occur when this plate uh, collide and their boundaries. And basically, dividing the Indian plate, you see, must carefully listen. The earthquake December 26, 2004, which occurred the west coast and northern Sumatra, took place in the uh, interfact and between the India and Burma plate. It is typically convergent plate boundary, and where the Indian plate moving at the right of 5 cm years and relatively, relatively to a Burma plate came together and collapsed on the Indian plate and divided subdivided under the uh, Burma plate and pushing in by 15 meters. The interaction of the Australian and Sunda and Eurasian plate in addition to the Indian and Burma plate made it more complicated what made in the Sumatra earthquake unique is that the focus and where the plate uh, rust shear actually there are take place in the inside of the earth of the earthquake was very near served only 10 kilometer deep hence a little combination of the huge magnitude and shallow depth focus led to high vertical uh, displacement of the Burma plate you know and that act like a great uh, piston and deforming the sea and it was almost as if a nuclear explosion had the taken place the under um, underneath the continental shelf in the interior of the earth and destructive the tectonic plate to cause the tsunami of the magnitudes clear and uh, basically advanced warning uh, despite the great speed tsunami and travel was slower than the seismic waves and the earthquake information is often available however before they are able to travel across the ocean and uh, uh, there are the epicenter of tsunami uh, as the occur on 24 December 2004 the speed of tsunami is directly related to the water depth it is uh, slow down as the entered the slower continental water and this result in decreasing uh, decreasing in the distance between the individual wave in a process called uh, shallowing and because of shallowing effect and tsunami that 
remains uh, impregnable in the deep water may uh, grow in there at the tsunami and tsunami uh, are more uh, frequent in pacific ocean and pacific tsunami warning center ptwc in the hawaii in the regional operational center for tsunami information in the pacific ocean and but there is no such warning uh, sometime it is the indian ocean and sensor on the ocean floor also so uh, definitely i clear about the earthquake and their effect and uh, must you will uh, like press like button and that's make inspire thank you thank you to all